YouTube. It's your boy Gamey Dad, and I'm back with another one. GameStop has just dropped their 2019 Thanksgiving Black Friday sales, and I'm here to give you the goodies on what's going on. Are you going out for Black Friday? Leave a comment in the section below. Let me know if you're going out or you're going to be behind your computer doing your Black Friday shopping that way. But however, you need to know the deal, so let's get into it. GameStop's sales start on Thursday, Thanksgiving, November 28th, at 3 p.m. Man, that's early. However, they got some doozies. Now, just about every store is giving out this um, um, this Mario Kart 8 bundle. But beware, Spawnway did a um, did some research and found out that this bundle is coming with the old Switch, not the one with the, be the better battery. So, parents, beware. If you know your son is going to need some extra time, don't get this bundle. It might be better off just buying the Mario Kart separately. But, however, if you buy it, you will get yourself a free $25 gift card. Get a Switch Lite from them, or you know what? Another free $25 gift card. Hey, you buy both systems, you're getting $50 in gift cards off the muscle. Now, there's some other doozy games on here, man, I want you to pay attention to. Now we go down to the next section. Anthem, $5. That is crazy. Is that game that bad? I want to know. Let me know in the comments area what you think about Anthem. Because I'm thinking I might pick that up for $5. You can't beat that. Modern Warfare, 38 bucks. You know what? They nickel and dime you. But if you at GameStop, you know what? I think you win. A dollar's a dollar. I know how much gas is. Division 2, 12 bucks. Mortal Kombat 11 great game on the switch and i heard it's dynamic on the ps4 or the xbox one get yourself for 28 dollars of course they get the nba 2k and the madden another sports game but i want you to look at the very bottom get yourself a refurbished xbox one for 99 dollars hey man that's 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 a great sale right there i don't know how good some of these newer games run on that original xbox i kind of want to know if you got yourself an original xbox one and you running some of these new games, how do they run? Once again, leave a comment. Let me know how, how that goes. But that one, they got that PS Pro All White Edition for $2.99. Ooh wee, that's tempting. And you get a $25 gift card. Hey, another good deal. And they also got that, that one PS4 um, bundle deal um, with the one terabyte. For $199, hey, I, I still gonna stick to my gun. That's the best deal of Black Friday for video games. If you if you have not gotten a PS4, now I'm not gonna spend too much time on this page here because they got the usual suspects. You know, the Gears 5 for $29.99, Red Dead for $29. If you haven't got those games yet, definitely worthy pickups. But however, man, why is WWE 2K20 on this page, man? That game is hot garbage. I wonder has it been patched yet. It's been patched. Let me know. In the comments area but you know what i haven't played days gone and i've always wanted to play days gone ever since i sent the first demo on e3 a couple of e3s ago so i might pick that one up but i got this other game too you know i gotta check the metacritic on um Sekiro. i forgot the name, the name of it but however it's 27.99 uh, for xbox one got it for ps4 too definitely i might check into that i'm gonna check to do some research to see how good that game is but once again if you know how good the game is let a brother know in the comments area Parents, if you grew up like I grew up, and you might have played a couple of Nintendo games, this one right here, The Legend of Zelda, man, is by far my favorite Zelda game. I mean, my favorite. And Ocarina of Time was my favorite until this one. This one right here has taken over the spot. But for $39.99, it's a pretty good, pretty good price. It's not the best, but you know what? I still think it's worthy of your pickup for $39.99. If you got a PS4, man, Spider-Man for $19.99 is a great price. But you know what? I believe this might be the best one because I think this is the Game of Year Edition. I don't know if any other stores are selling the Game of Year Edition. I haven't noticed that. But for $19.99, I know I've seen it cheaper for $15. But for $19.99, Game of Year Edition, this is definitely a, a worthy pickup. There's a couple other noteworthy ones. Um, you know, King of Union, the Kingdom Hearts. I had Kingdom Hearts for $19.99. Jump Force for $19.99. My kids didn't care for it too much, I have to be honest. But you know what? It might be what you want to do. 
Uh, Resident Evil 2 for $19.99. I believe I seen that cheaper for 15 bucks. You might want to check Best Buy or uh, even Target, but hey, you know, it's still for 20 bucks, man. It's nominated for Game of the Year. You can't go wrong with Resident Evil 2. And the games keep on rolling under $25. We got Darksiders 3 for $9.99. Man, I have not played Darksiders 3, but if it's anything like the first two games, I might have to pick this one up. Also on the list, Bioshock. 1999 classic that's man i wish they port all the bioshocks to the switch now listen they will make so much money oh, they get um lion king versus aladdin i said well, i said versus i don't know why but lion king and aladdin 1999 the witcher 3 the complete edition for the ps4 1999 then i gotta pay 50 bucks for the switch however i love it on my switch i ain't, I ain't tripping uh, other couple of North, noteworthy games. You got um, Friday the 13th for 1999. I heard that was pretty fun. Bloodstained for 1999 is a steal. This is out of this whole page. This to me is like if I didn't have this game, I would definitely pick this one up. I kind of want to know what's what's going on with Into the Dead too um, for the Switch. I've seen some gameplay. Kind of like what I saw. If you played this game, let me know which, how you thought about it in the uh, comments area. All right, these next set of games start at $29.99. I'm just gonna highlight a couple of the, one, the key ones I think you probably should be looking into. Control, a, a Game of the Year nominee, $29.99. I think I might have to pick that one up just because I like games with good stories. You got Tomb Raider down there. I didn't too much like the second Tomb Raider, but you know what, I mean, it's Tomb Raider. You're gonna have some good fun if you haven't played it before, especially the first one. The first one was outstanding for the Xbox. Um, this is probably definitely a pretty good pickup for $29.99. Um, you got the grid down here for $39.99. I don't know. I don't know how good grid was to be $40. Bucks. But however, it's $40. Bucks. All right. You know, if you like racing games, you know, you don't got no... Um, if you're done with Forza, this right here might fit your bill. Now, a lot of these items on this page here I've already covered. You know, unless you want some Pokemon toys... Or you want to get Pokemon that's not on sale for $59.99. But I want to draw your attention to the bottom right corner. Hey, man, your, your funds might be kind of slim. And you probably just want you a Switch just to put on the TV. However, man, a used Switch for $249, man, you can't beat that. So you, those of you who pockets is kind of slim, you might just want to look at getting you a Switch and pick up some used games. you probably save a ton of money. Now, if you move too fast, you just might miss a couple of the gems that's on this page. And there's a couple of them you, you probably should definitely pay attention to. I'm going to bring your attention to the top right corner. Underneath the PS, uh, the white PS4, uh, PlayStation Plus $44.99 for the full year. That is a steal. That is a great deal. A deal I'm going to take advantage of because mine has expired. But I'm picking it up from GameStop for $44.99 hands down they're not gonna run out of those of course you know every every store got the um ps4 controllers on sale you didn't see the 199 ps4 but i haven't talked enough about that but i'm gonna let you slide on down you might miss this other gym get yourself a two terabyte hard drive for your gaming system your xbox or your your ps4 might be running out of storage you can get it for 64.99 that's a great deal. Great, great deal for two terabytes. Um, but you know what? At the bottom, something I haven't talked about yet is the VR bundles. They got two of them here at GameStop. Unlike everybody else, everybody else has got really one bundle for sale. But they got two of them down here. And the first one is for $249. You get the Blood Truth um, game and the Everybody's Golf VR bundle for $249. And on the other side, you get for $199, you get the VR bundle and five games. Even though I've never been big on VR. And I don't know if I dip into it for that kind of price point. But I think in the next the next VR 2 for PlayStation or whoever, I think I might dip into that. Because if you have not seen video yet of that Half-Life game on VR, oh buddy, that looks real good. The deals for these great games keep on rolling. And man, if UFC 3... My kids, especially my oldest son, you know, he gets down on his UFC. 
Devil May Cry 5 for 20 bucks is a pretty good price, even though I've seen it cheaper for 15. So be on the lookout. I believe I think either Target or Best Buy have this has it cheaper for 15 bucks. But I want to I want you to kind of gravitate to the very bottom, man. These PlayStation hits are crazy for ten dollars. If you don't have these games, I, I don't see a game on there that I say, okay, I wouldn't pick up. You know, at um, I don't believe they got Little Big Planet 3, but Little Big Planet 3 is a great game for ten dollars. But Horizon Zero Dawn, The Last of Us, Uncharted, the Uncharted Collection series, Bloodborne, God of War, Persona 5. Grand Turismo. I mean, you got some classics for ten dollars. I mean, this is my thing. If, if you're just buying a PS4 for the first time, or you're just buying it for your kids, and you want some good games, now depending on how, depending on their ages, I mean, you got you can't go wrong with them games at the bottom for ten dollars. I mean, ooh. This is another page. I'm not gonna spend too much time on. I just want to make a couple comments. When you look at this Xbox uh, One Digital. Man, that's tempting for $150 to get yourself Minecraft, Fortnite, Sea of Thieves. Man, if you got a great internet connection, and you know what, and if you don't have anything and your funds is running low, man, that Xbox One Digital is tempting. Even though I'm a straight cartridge guy. Will always be a cartridge guy. But hey, you gotta go where your funds go. That's a great deal. I just wanna slide down and look at the bottom too. You know what, I wanted to pick up one of these gaming uh, cases down here with it. TV attached, but man, that's still way too much money, man. I just can't see myself paying $179. Fucking well, probably give me a 50 inch color TV with 4K and HDR for the same price. <sighs> they gotta come down on them prices on them TVs, man. For parents just not getting the Switch, and you got some girls in the house. I hate to be sexist on this, but you know what? You and girls play Just Dance. My daughter played Just Dance. Hey, $24.99. You might want to pick that up from there. I haven't seen it really any place else. I think Best Buy might have had it for around the same price, so you can't go wrong. Even though it's $49.99, if you're an adult gamer, man, and you on the go a lot, The Witcher 3, man, is excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Uh, it's like the adult version of Zelda, but not as good as Zelda. <laughs> I still think Breath of the Wild is better than this. But however, that's a good game. Uh, but if you scroll down, man, Ghostbusters, man, Ghostbusters surprised me so much. I never, I didn't play it on the 360, but man, that was a great game, man. Ghostbusters for 1999, that is the steal. Pick that one up for sure. Um, my son bought the Dragon Ball Z game, but you know what? He only played it for like a hot second and was like he was done with it. So uh, even though it's 24.99, you might want to pass on that one. Mario vs. Rabbits excellent game i'm telling you i never beat it i played it a lot with my kids but um it was a fun time it's a nice fun multiplayer uh, experience and um another one i want to speak on final fantasy man final fantasy man they have the best stories man and i'm not a big rpg guy but you know what them final fantasy games be dope so uh, for the price they offered it for i think i might have seen it five dollars cheaper but if you're you get locked into gamestop man you might well pick this one up too and if you like Lego games, they're all on sale for 1989. You can't beat that. I picked up the um, DC Super Villains, and I'm starting to play that, starting to like that. Uh, I was never a big uh, Lego guy, but you know what? This has been kind of fun. The story is hilarious. All right in the last page of the Black Friday ad, I'm not going to speak too much on this one either, but a couple of them. Hey, I got Wolfenstein Young Bloods for the Switch on the Buddy Pass, and me and my son has been going at it. Crazy fun. Um, the frame rate not the best on the Switch, but man, I can just imagine how it is on the Xbox. So, probably definitely a pickup if you got somebody to play with. Um, Metro Exodus, I want to pick up that game, but she's coming out for the Switch. You know, I'm a Switch guy for right now because I'm so I'm always on the go. That's another good one. Borderlands, you can't go wrong with any of the Borderlands collections. $14.99, pretty much they, it's pretty much like they're giving away the game. Maybe you are an impatient shopper and you just got money burning a hole in your pocket. And you know what? You might not want to go out to the hustle and bustle of Black Friday, but you want to get some of them deals right now. GameStop got you covered. Right now, starting on Sunday the 24th. You know what those, those nice games we saw for $10? They got you. Starting on the 24th. Some of them Black Friday sales that we already talked about. 
it's opening up wide and loose on the 24th all the way to the second that means all the way through black friday so you can get them deals right now that ps4 bundle 199 get it early on sunday that all white ps um 4 pro 299 spider-man days gone 1999 last of us god of war uncharted and the list goes on and on 1999 you want you some vr you need some vr in your life oh yeah get them vrs for 249 and 199 i'm telling you man these deals is crazy and if you thought gamestop was done psych they're not man i just want to draw your attention to the bottom right corner i did not pick up a genesis mini i got the super nintendo mini i got the nes mini I did not pick up a Genesis Mini for this reason. I'm waiting for Black Friday. And there it is for $30 cheaper. And I'm picking that bad boy up. Man, I got my have to take a little small loan for all these, these systems I got coming out here. But I got to pick one up. Another gem that I have not seen in anybody's paper, period. The Guacamole Double Pack for $24.99. Let me tell you, Guacamole was probably my favorite PS Vita game hands down I mean my favorite I mean the ones I played the most and played over and over again guacamole especially the first one is outstanding the second one was good too I even though I didn't, I didn't finish the second one but I finished the first one I tell you guacamole man is a steal you pick that one up hands down and also you know what you know Rockstar got that LNUR 1999 I think that should be cheaper it, it should really be 999 it's been out a long time if you haven't got it by now you're not gonna get it uh, Genesis Collection at the top for $14.99. Another one that you know what you'll slip on, especially if you like old school retro games. And GameStop is going to end it on this deal here, getting you all your Xbox systems on sale, all your Xbox games 50% off. Get your controller. Ooh, $59.99. That's not a deal. I've seen them a whole lot better at other places. So I will definitely pass unless you just got to have a certain color they're offering and no one else is offering um, pass on that xbox controller at gamestop but um hey man we're at the end of my video man thank you for hanging out with me this is your boy gaming dad from things to get ready to change with the channel we're just moving in a, in a great direction i thank you guys for the support man we about 60 subscribers away from 5,000. who would have thought two months ago that would have 5,000 subscribers but man we'll continue to keep pushing it man hit the subscribe button man you know become a supporter of this channel man we just really doing some great things and once again, this is your boy Gaming Dad. I will have all the games. Well, listen, I can't say all the games. But I'll have a, quite a few of the games linked in my description. I am a Amazon affiliate. If you see something on there closer to Black Friday, you hit the link. If they got it cheaper on Amazon, it's a win-win for you and for me. I do get a percentage of that. So feel free to support me that way. If you're going to buy something anyway, why not click through my link? This is your boy Gaming Dad. I hope you enjoyed today. And we are out. Peace.